We're going to turn now to Dr. Jen Ashton here with some of the medical answers or med answers to your questions. Right. And we'll start with the first one. Are KF94 or KN95 masks necessary when indoors in public spaces? Short answer, Amy, is no. And we've heard the new CDC director address this issue because a lot of people in the lay public are saying, well, if these new variants are more transmissible, transmissible do we need different kinds of masks? We have to remember that the N95 respirators are fit tested for people's faces and they are used in healthcare settings. They are completely different than the cloth face coverings that's recommended by the CDC. And these KN95s or 94s, there are a ton of counterfeits. Yeah. So right now, there is no official recommendation to change the kind of masks we're wearing when we're in indoor spaces. Just remember, wear a mask. All right, question number two here. Have we learned any additional info about how the virus variants are affecting children? We don't know about this yet too early, but there is some information and it's good news about children, um, especially in a classroom setting. It does look based on the available evidence and data that the transmission in a classroom seems to be low. We don't yet know if the variants are causing more infection or disease, clinical disease in children. Um, but we know that overall the rates are going up in children, but that is most likely a reflection just of our rates mm. in the country going up. You can submit your questions to Dr. Ashton on our Instagram at Dr. J. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.